Oh, shit. How did this even happen? There are legends that dwell within the hidden... Hey guys, welcome to the show. Hey D, good to see ya. All right, hang on, let me just. All right, put you there. Put this over here. Elgato's working. Mike is working. Chat's working. All right, let's get on with this. Uh, from one shitty day at work to a stream. Oh, and where the fuck is this one? All right. All right, so I believe um, last session we ended on genocide, I believe it was. All right, so... Okay, so something we're going to need to do is we're actually going to need to go buy produce. Believe it or not, we genuinely genuinely are gonna have to buy some produce here in a second uh map all right where is the closest oh god it's all the way the fuck over there all right let's just get to work while we're over here we can probably go buy um another treasure map real quick what does produce do well produce is your food basically you can buy like you know food that'll give you like attack up um uh, magic up uh, health up all that shit you know what i mean so basically, it's a quick way to get, like, healing items, which we're good on healing items right now. We have, um, 1991, so that's fine, but we don't want to use our energy fruit. We want to save that for character two. So it goes base fruit, better fruit, even better fruit, potion, and then it just keeps recycling. So at a glance, you can actually, um, get whatever you need from this menu cool design i wish more games would do shit like this especially if there's consumables in the game i've never we walked right past produce hang on we gotta talk to shady guy uh -huh. treasure lost in dareback ridge it's only two 200 hmm. it ain't that bad we can we can get that in a second to do this one to do list one genocide groceries yes indeed dark souls souls four kids version why why are you right? I'm shocked at how right you are. Four kids version is apt too, like Jesus. Something I hate in this game is they always start you you enter a building and the camera's facing you. It's like fucking what's to stop the camera from being right here? Spawn me a little bit forward and just like, you know. Alright, what are we working with here? Alright, these are star fruit. Fucking hell! All right, so we can buy, like, a few of these, I guess. All right, how many did that give us? Four. Could be better. All right, do you have a mission? Mm. Yeah, Peach Buzz and Cog Am. Cool. Good to know. All right. All right, so let's get to work here. So there's a treader in Daragak... Darab... <laughs> Daragak... Fuck these stupid names. I'm going the wrong way. Where the fuck? Hang on a second. Okay, I thought the game crashed for a second. I was about to lose my shit. Yeah, okay, it's this way. Ooh, hang on. I see that. I think that was a smoke or was that a shadow? Yeah, it was a smoke mode. <laughs> things so as I was saying before we have to be careful about how many of those we kill because um, believe it or not if you kill too many of these Dar Daragax or whatever the fuck they're called more enemies spawn in the I think it's act 3 or act 4 <laughs> fucking badger dragons hey SM good to see you buddy is this, um, 
No, that goes up to somewhere else or other. I don't think we need to go that way just yet. Ooh, I do see this, though. Hang on. Oh, shit. All right, you know what? Um, um, let's see here. All right, so put this right here. Turn around, you fat bastard. All right. Good shit. Ah, oh, shit, there's more of these things. No, fuck, I'm not fighting all these fucking things. Oh, that's a big one. Never mind, I never mind. Yeah, I did like the fallout show. Oh fuck! Ooh, an egg. Ooh, a red one. Perfect. Hey, cool, that's a health bonus for us. Keep running. Keep running. I didn't like how they retconned a few things, but otherwise the show was good. Like I was genuinely shocked at how good the show was. Like I had no right being as good as it was. Oh, fuck. Ow. Later, nerds! Cool. Alright, that was worth coming over here. I mean, like I said, like I said in the Discord, it's a definite 8.8 8, 8 out of 10. Like, there are some things that kind of drove me up the wall about it, specifically, like, you know, them retconning, like, how the bombs dropped, which was really stupid because that's Bethesda breaking their own fucking lore. But, you know, what did they, they care, you know what I mean? Everyone hates the hates 3 and 4 anyways. My grandma watched it with my five-year-old sis while I was playing Smash Bros. in my room. Yeah, video games are notoriously hard to adapt in TV and movies, especially something like, you know, Fallout, like... Okay, here's why Fallout is so unique. In New Vegas, you can talk to Joshua Graham, a man that was covered in pitch, set on fire, and thrown into the um, Grand Canyon. He is a reformed Mormon, for God's sakes. And this man has forgiven and, like, you know, all that shit, right? And, you know, you go on a big journey, him talking about the hate that's in his heart and, like, you know, everything that... A fucking fire moat, you son of a bitch! THAT'S ALL I GET! Anyways, um, and you know, you, you go, you follow him on his journey of religion and you know, him dealing with the hate in his heart and learning how to be a better person. In the same fucking game, you talk to fucking Elvis, you help him fix his cyborg dog by taking it to a, a fucking ski lodge full of mutants and then, because it needs a new brain. Like, Jesus Christ. Like, how do you deal with a game that has such shifting, like, um, what's the word I'm looking for here? Uh, just such shifting... Fuck. I'm losing my train of thought because I'm getting angry. Or, not angry, but I'm getting passionate. Alright, nothing from these fucking things. But yeah. There we go. Come on. I only played Fallout 4. That's acceptable. Fallout 4 isn't the worst game, it's just the story's garbage. It has good gameplay, though. But, you know, what can you do? Alright, so I'm not gonna start this um, Dareback Ridge um, quest until we actually need the money. Because, like I said, if we fuck up, more enemies spawn later. Which is, is a common beginner's trap for this shit. Drastic tonal shifts? Well, yeah, man! You go from, you go from, um, reading the logs of a vault that are, like, succumbing to, like, plant-based mutations, and then you cut to, Oh, thank you very much for saving my dog, who needs a new brain from that, with that ski lodge full of mutants. Here, you can keep him. <laughs> Gee, thanks, thanks, Elvis. <laughs> like, that's, that's literally what we're dealing with here. That's a wind moat. I'm gonna swipe that. Yep, go fuck yourself, poison spiders. Alright, hang on. Saving game. Because this game this game likes to crash, especially in Cogam for some reason. I don't know what it does it. 
You talk about drastic tonal shifts, though. Oh, moats are the moats are consumables. Yes, exactly. You don't just you don't just get, so you see every number by the moats. Basically, that's how many that's that's the rating of how many I have left. Essentially, every hit takes about four or five or one, depending upon how lucky you are. So the more um, clovers you find, the less moats you use, and the more moats you find, essentially. And a full meter, you find like um, two moats on every enemy, almost, or a moat on every enemy, I should say. Don't crash! Don't crash! Don't crash! Thank you. All right, we've made it to fucking Cogham or Cogham. I'm never sure how to pronounce it. And the centaurs are raising this place to the fucking ground. I would eat a moat. I don't know how they taste because they're technically alive. But because they're technically alive, that means they're edible. Flesh. So the centaurs are genociding the people of Kogam. But I really do like the look of this place. It's really like... I don't know how to describe it. It's very homely. Reminds me of like a, a village in like um, Ocarina of Time or something. Almost like Gerudo Valley, but like more northeastern. Or mid-northwest, I should say. Like almost like Native American-esque. Like you... Uh, how do I describe this? Um... You know that feeling when you walk into like a um, Cabela's or a um, like a like a um, Bass Pro Shop? That vaguely like American slash like Wild Western type of feel to it. Like that's what I get from this place. Like Wild West canyons and stuff. You know what I mean? Like strict Americana is what we're talking about. Bitch. Remember the guild days in the Xbox 360 Minecraft, not gonna lie? Rustic! Thank you, Shepard! You will not sell these people into slavery! That's another one dead! Another fucking Hoover dead! Guys, we have to think up slurs for centaurs real quick. What do we what do we call these guys? Oh god, I didn't look at that. They're dead in there. Oh fuck. That is a proper house fire. I hope I don't become the dumbass I was last stream. I it should be fine. I don't, I, I don't think you said anything stupid, SM. Fuck though, man. <laughs> They're dead in there. Goat bellies? Oh, I like that one. Tried to panic, tried to brag. Breathe, breathe. It's not working, Rod! Some of the dialogue in this game is okay. I said it would like four times. All oh, right. Some help here. I'm needing some assistance. Where's Gershwin? He'd know what to do. What the? Where am I fucking going here? Yeah, I would go into the things to buy some shit, but they're clearly fucking... The building's on fire. I can't go in right now. Six limbs. I kind of like six limbs. Kind of has the same, like, um, guttural thing as, like, split lips. You could go in with the side effect of burning. <laughs> and they're dead. We better run and tell the boss what's happening. Jesus Christ, he killed all he killed all of the forward team. We gotta go! Yeah, he sure isn't gonna be very happy about it. Holy fuck! I think he killed Timmy, Tommy, and Tony. Oh fuck! That's right. 
well met squire where's the knight you serve he is he's not here yet then when is he coming <laughs> um i'm not sure <laughs> look at, at Tor's fucking face <laughs> what is what emotion is that what emotion is he trying to convey is he is he upset is he sad is he fucking pissed what emotion is that his eyes like a slit what am I looking at here Me and my grandma made mac and cheese today. Best homemade shit I ever had. Dude, mac and cheese, you slice up some hamburger, you throw some fucking sharp cheddar. Dubious! I love that. Dubious. Meaning unsure. He's just become Asian! You sent our video for four hours! You go- Okay, no, never mind. Okay, that was that was a bit risky on my part. I probably shouldn't have even attempted that. What? What was M Meridel thinking? They we're only getting a squire, but I drove them away. <laughs> only back to their camp. They'll keep coming back until their leader is gone, and so are we. Shut the fuck up. Good. Calm yourself. Calm down. You calm the fuck down. I got this. Fucking Tor picks him up and throws him off the cliff. <laughs> I was not expecting Asia. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't. I wasn't expecting it either. I wasn't. I wasn't quite prepared for me to myself to do that. So Merida finally sent someone to help. About time. Yeah, about time. Anyways, let's go. What a great fight. I think you, bastard. Yeah. There's like a gnat flying around here. I just saw it. Yeah, it's it, it's definitely spring for sure. Be careful not to fall off and die. Specifically, I was referencing the fucking Mandarin from um, Robot Chicken when um, um, Iron Man is infiltrating the Mandarin's base and um, he he alerts all the guards at once and he accidentally turns his boosters on and he like shreds two guys at once and the Mandarin comes out and the Mandarin pulls what I just said. Because that was the first thing that came to mind. I don't know why. I have school. I have to... I have school tomorrow. Spring break is not long at all. Bro. Damn. I remember that feeling when I was a kid. Just fucking spring break's already over. What the fuck is this thing? Yuck, it's some kind of slimy sea pod and it's pulsating. I bet this thing will help Epstein's ellipses plants grow? Who the fuck is that? Oh shit, that's a mountain crow! These fucking things can pick you up and throw you off the cliff. You gotta be careful. Ah! I think these guys are fire motes? Hang on a second. We'll figure that out in just a second. God, I always love playing, like, fashion souls with the motes. It's such, it's such a cool, like, looking mechanic. To use a pulsing object. <laughs> hey yo, pulsating! <laughs> My god. Yeah, it's like it's like whenever ever, ever anyone says the word moist, it's just pulsating or throbbing. Throbbing's another one. Yeah, these guys are oh shit. Do not fall off the cliff, Port! Okay, I don't think these are guys of fire. Let's try Earth. Yep, they're, 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 um, they are Earth. Wait, there we just should be wind then. What the fuck am I doing? Moist is just critical. Exactly. That, that reaction video, I, I've actually recorded a few action, reaction videos, believe it or not, because I see that reaction content does very, very well. So, uh, oh yeah, these guys are Earth. Okay. Anyways, as I was saying, um... I actually reacted to Critical's video. It should be going up eventually here. But, um, that's the maddest I've ever seen him. It, it was nuts, dude. Dead. I don't think we've 
even gotten the quest for the weird fucking plant thing. I think it's not even a quest until like late game. Ah, silver neg. I I can't play this game anymore, man. Cause my fucking my fucking stupid adult adult brain went to that fucking meme of like Sonic and Mario at the Olympics and everyone makes the meme of like negative Eggman as Eggman Nega and it's just like oh god cuz I just I literally just thought about it like there's one person that played this game and said that why the hell did they call why didn't they just call him negative Eggman dude it sounds so weird when they when the announcer says what he does dude a star bear. I could I could eat these all day. They're a pretty good cure for headaches too. You absolute buffoon. These are mags, not clips. In the same way, these <laughs> pulls out a rocket launcher. These are mags. Fuck! Stop distracting me. I'm dying. I remember this being like a controlling a lot better when I was a kid. Just like Negachin, exactly. Ow! You son of a. Not enough. Bastard. Alright, um, LU. How much more of this do we have to- OH! WHERE THE FUCK AM I?! WHAT IS THIS MAP?! WHERE THE FUCK IS ANYTHING?! ARE THOSE ELEVATIONS?! WHAT IS THIS?! Oh, how did it slip by the production team along with Nick or Treat? Oh, exactly. Motherfucker took a side quest. Exactly. Nick or Treat. What the fuck were they thinking, man? Ow! Prepare to die! You are now slowed! I literally just hit this Ibex Rider with a fucking bolt of lightning. Alright, you know what? Fuck you. I'm totally gonna set set the leader on fire. Absolutely. fucking lootly. Yes. I think we actually might get to the next act um, tonight if I, you know, just keep streaming. <laughs> Alright. Where the fuck am I? Okay, I think I'm still going the right direction. Oh god, no, I'm going the other way. Hang on a second, where? What's this way? What the fuck am I looking at? Do I have to make that jump right there? Oh, apparently, yeah! Now, what's over here? Oh! That's over here. I think I can do this. Oh god! Jesus Christ, you hurt! Slow 
he fucking hurts and hits like a truck. Fuck. That's bullshit. Damn. All right, no, I can still, I can get this guy. Hang on a second. I need to figure out what he's weak to. All right, so I imagine he's a dragon, so let's try this. I doubt he's weak to light, but I have to see. Damn it. Yeah, he's really tough. I'm not trying to do the spin attack. I don't know why Tor keeps doing it. Let's see what he was guarding. Is that it? He was he was guarding a lava moat. That wasn't worth it. We we went through all of our healing for that? Fuck this game. That wasn't worth it. That literally wasn't worth it. We're down to no red anymore. Jesus Christ. That was so fucking lame. I was expecting at least a trash with cash. A, a trash. A chest with cash in it, but no. I got fucking scammed. I got the whole rest of the dungeon to fight through now. Jesus God. What? No, don't lose the money! Jesus, Tor! I'm not sure if I can make that jump. Yeah, those guys are weak to Earth. All right, so I'm not sure if I can make that jump. I can't jump back up there. Ah, fuck it. Ah! More Ibex. All right. Oh, shit! All right, you know, fuck this. They don't, they're not dropping anything good. Ow. What do we got here? Relude mine. I don't think I need to go that way. Yeah, can't go that way either. Okay. Up we go. Can't go that way either. Okay. Where the fuck do I go? Yeah, okay, that way's blocked off. Oh! No, wait, I came that way. I see a rainbow moat down there. Holy shit. How do I get to that side, then? Okay, maybe... Maybe don't get a, too close to the edge, Shindarius. All right. How the fuck do I do this? Okay, definitely not going this way. You know, I would watch. You know, I would. W I would watch another. You know, I would watch another Lethal Company stream. I've been thinking about that, but it's been absolute fucking murder trying to get a group together because I've tried 
playing Lethal Company again, you can't play that game with randos. You need people to play that game. It just doesn't work. Ow! Okay, this way. I see. I was meant to- FUCKING TORT! This game has an auto jump feature like it's fucking Legend of Zelda, but sometimes the auto jump feature doesn't work. As anyways, I was saying, like, I've been trying to fucking get a group together for Lethal Company. I just can't get one together. Can't even play it. I have Xbox. Damn. Hang on. Hang on. Fuck. I just saw that damn thing. Sorry, there's a little gnat flying around. I just try I'm just trying to get a good point to kill it, but I just can't fucking find the moment. Hang on, let me switch back to the other way around. Alright. Save the Starberry for the boss fight. Ow! Ow! I hate any bug because it's just annoying. Exactly. My thought process is if you're if you're if you're coming into my space and you are altering my lifestyle, you fucking die. Oh, bees absolutely deserve to, to live. You know what I mean? Bees are important. I'm gonna go on a lark and say that water's too fucking deep. I used to think the Ibex were all female because of just the way they, um, just how their barks are. You know what I mean? Sounds rather effeminate to me. Which is why I initially, like, um, compared this place to Gerudo Valley in a way. You know what I mean? Because I, I thought, I used to think that they were all female. Which is kind of weird now that I think about, like, thinking back on it. It's like, why would all of the centaurs specifically be female? Then again, I was uh, probably a dumb kid that didn't really know what sex was, so, you know what I mean? Probably nothing out of the ordinary there. Then again, I never really put two and two together about Gerudo Valley, either. I don't think a lot of us did as kids. Keyword, as kids. Rock. I love how pissed off the rock looks, if I'm being honest. It's like one of my favorite looking moats. It just looks like. Mm, fucking. <laughs> really just a fucking. Fuck! Missed! I gotta get one of those things that's like. It, it, it emits the light that kills the bugs. God, real, real original fucking people that have been attached to this channel for a long time will remember the fucking, um, they'll remember the fucking, um, Hollow, Hollow Knight fucking, um, bug, bug streams where I fucking was trying to kill that one fly for straight up probably a, a, a week. Oh, God. When did bro learn? I learned the same time as everyone else in my classroom. When we had the weird ass sex ed class. Bro, they had a fucking free fab ready to go video about fucking puberty and shit, man. And all the fifth graders saw it and you had to go get your your parents' signature. And straight up, I ain't even fucking lying, they had one specifically for like the next grade up that was a little bit more in depth. God. <laughs> at one, at one point, 
at one point in the fucking video that we watched, fucking. <laughs> Fuck, don't stop! At one point in the video, I, I, I very, I very, very vividly remember fucking, um. There is this, there's this thing where this. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just it's just really funny to laugh about. So so like basically it's like this book, right? Like and he's telling these two kids about puberty and shit. Um and um like like they, they they're talking about the um the JJ and the donger right and <laughs> this little girl god bless her soul but like she's obviously like probably 10 or 11 in the movie and she dead ass looks at like the animated book thing and she goes but how big will my breasts get <laughs> <laughs> And the kid, the fucking boy, who's obviously nine, doing this because his mom wants him to have an acting credit. He's like, and how big will my, my penis be? And it's just like, no one talks like that. <laughs> and the worst, the worst part is that it's all we would fucking reference. We would just reference these videos constantly on the playground. Oh god, that just unlocked a memory for me. Oh shit, it's the final boss. Or not the final boss, but it's the boss. Okay, I'm gonna set that fucker on fire. Actually, no, I'm gonna poison them. And then slow them. I was two when I learned what it was, not gonna lie. Bullshit, because you don't have your... You don't have your fucking, like, faculties at two. My ass. So, how I thought it was, was that all the Ibex Raiders were female, and the boss was the only male. They thought they were teaching sex ed, but really they were just creating memes for a lifetime. You let one little squire with a sword run you out of town? Oh wait, no, I thought the boss was a female too. Yeah, that's right, I thought they were all girls. Well, he's, uh, tougher than he looks. I think he had some friends. Yeah, really big friends. Shut up! Just take him out. Yeah, boss. Sure thing. Oh, shit. That's one. I'll show you, Meridel scum, not to interfere with our business. Okay, that jumpy want to get in there. I'm going to enjoy this. They have a cool ass Dark Maul axe, though. Fuck, not enough magic! Oh, yeah, yours is water, so damn it. Hang on. Got him. Playtime's over, is it? You fucking six limbs. Man, I walked into my parents having shed more times than I can count. Shed, what the hell is autocorrect doing? Protecting the innocent, that's what. And he's dead!
What are you waiting for? Finish him off. <laughs> They're like, man, fuck this. Cowards. Nobody in chat is innocent. The boss's eye patch. This should be proof that the IX Rangers have been defeated. One lowly squire defeated, dismantled and defeated an entire colony of centaurs. Yeah, that's what you get, you fucking six limbs! This is our land, not yours anymore! It's a fucking water moat. Oh shit. Okay, I'm sorry, I thought I was about to clip out a world there for a second. Sixers! We can call them Sixers! Damn! Ah, I wish, I wish fucking, I fucking wish he was still alive and I had a better slur to call. <laughs> I just realized what I was saying and how bad that could sound out of context. Holy shit! I gotta be a fuck! What?! What do you mean, game over? Fuck! I forgot, some of the water has instant- it, This is- this is the bullshit I'm talking about. Some of the water has, like, instant, like, kill you shit. Ah, oh, that pisses me off. So smart enough to save right after. Like, here's the bullshit. I fell into the water earlier, right? And that just spawned me back there. Why did that kill me? That's another thing I literally just remembered about this game, that some of the... Like, the game has no reason for, like, you know, like, oh yeah, okay, this water kills you versus the other water just respawns you back at the beginning of the jumping puzzles. Like, there's one area in the game that's really, really bad. Be like, see, what? Why did that respawn me here? Where the fuck am I even? Like, you see what I mean? Like, okay, that respawned me there. Why the fuck did that, like, kill me the last time and game over me? This game makes no fucking sense, man. Makes me want to commit tax fraud. Specifically, tax fraud. Bro, I am dreading having to cut this fucking thing up and make it into a series. I can't believe you beat him. Listen, we can't do much, but we will make sure that the king hears about your bravery. You have the heart of a knight. Here, good so A redneck to commemorate your victory. See, like, they just give you a redneck this time around. It's like, you know, but, oh, but the fucking... Oh, my God. Look at how happy Tor is with himself. Look at how fucking happy he is. Oh, now he's, now he's, now he's impatient. All right. Um, produce. I think you're the one that needs that fucking seed pod. Mm. Esplith. All right. I feel I must apologize. We're a poor village and I don't have much. Oh, you're one of those, like, Twi'lek ones. He is amused. Most plants don't grow in the rocky soil around here. Want to know my secret? I use these strange pods that grow wild plants mm -hmm. to make them grow. You can find me one of those. I will give you something in return. Have this. You found a growth pod. Thank you so much. Hey, Red Nag. So that's two health upgrades, and we're going to need them. All right, so first things first, we ignore the produce. We ignore the moats. We need to get a new weapon and shield, because this is why I've been saving up so much money. 
Burn Burnin the blacksmith. Welcome to the Burnham Smithy. So they have a wand here, but we can't use a wand. So fuck that. We want the sword, the knight sword, the big ass sword. Now that's a sword worthy of a knight. Look at that fucking thing. Look at enemies of Meridel. Look at how big my fucking sword is now. It's it's almost as tall. Jesus Christ, it is almost as tall as me. Hang on. So yeah, it, it, it pretty much is like three inches off from being... Tor, Tor can swing a blade that's almost his height. What a fucking jack... Uh, I don't remember what these guys are fucking called. I, call, I think they're called a Lupin? Or a Lupus? I don't know. It clipped into your body for a split second. Yes, it did. Uh, ah, then we need this. I hear the raiders are gone. It's time to celebrate. Because this motherfucker has an iron shield. I love the little tune that plays every single time you upgrade. Sure, it's better than wood, but boys, it's heavy. So yeah, we got an iron shield, which is super cool. And we got a, a knight sword made out of steel instead of iron. God, I love the I love the fucking weapon upgrades for this. They cost a fortune though. Mission successful. Return to Meridel Castle. Why aren't they giving you free shit? You saved them from arson. Cause they're poor, SM. Because they're literally poor. They can't afford to give me anything. They say a fool and her things are soon par parted. I'm telling you, my friend, it's true, and that fool is me. Aw, oh, cute. Alright, uh, give me this treasure map. All right, the starry neg. I think the starry neg instantly gives you a mana bonus. I don't know. Let's see. Starry neg. This is one of the rarest of all negs. I'm sure it will do something. Yeah, yeah. So that's more magic. All right, good, good, good. All right. Um, starlight potion, treasure map. What other what treasure map did I? Meridel Farms treasure. Oh God, we're not gonna see that for ages. That doesn't matter. Steal from the poor. Reverse Robin Hood. All right. Shadow Glen treasure. Fuck sakes, we're not gonna see that forever. Ah! I just got fucking scammed. All right. Um, there's a gift place here, I think. Right. Um, yeah, treasure place. All right, here. What do you got for here? Oh, we just fucking went in here. Damn it. All right, um, yeah, let's bounce. We have everything we need here. How much money do we have? Uh, 2,000, all right, that should be enough for the armor. Because there's one more thing we get, because there's an armor upgrade you can get, which they don't fucking tell you about, which, oh, God, it pisses me off to no end. So this game doesn't tell you about the upgrades in it. So you can just head back to, so basically, you, you see there? Mission successful. Return to Meridel. And you would just return to Meridel and you would miss out on all the upgrades in this town. They don't tell you in this game, like, oh, hey, by the way, there's a sword upgrade and a shield upgrade you need. They're expensive and you should probably get them. They don't tell you that. They don't. And I missed out on this upgrade for years as a kid. It wasn't until I was a little bit older I realized, oh, hey... There's an armor upgrade here. My only ever clue was that Tor doesn't look the same in the cutscenes. And I was always like, man, that's dumb. So I was wearing my squire armor, like, up into Act 3 and nearly dying and taking too much damage. Ah, oh, it pisses me off. It makes me so mad. So mad to think back on it. Just the struggle I had wasn't fucking fair. Alright, where are we? Yeah, there's no reason to go into the box canyon until, um... Well, of course they don't tell you they don't want to pay extra for extra actors. Oh, God. Yeah, but they can at least do a fucking text box. It's like, go to, go get your new armor, son. Or, like, you know. Also, it's not even fucking given to you. It's... Oh, it's bullshit. We don't have money for moats because I want to buy the armor. I'd rather, I'd rather buy the armor and just find the moats later. Oh, fuck, they 
between a mare down. Let's save this one. I really hope this leads to Meridel, because I think I took the wrong I think I went the wrong direction. Nope, Meridel's right there. Siri, tell me this guy's location. Nice balls, bro. I really need to stop being off topic. Oh, for God's sakes. The music's bugged again. The one thing that nearly constantly bugs in this fucking game is the music. That reset button. Okay. Playing with the music bugged is dangerous because the game freezes more often when the music is bugged than when it's not. So that's why I'm going through resetting because I don't want to crash in the middle of something. Can you tell I, I was I was spurned by this game one too many times as a child. I always kind of like that intro screen. Oh, that was the render. That was the render of the fucking darkest fairy when she doesn't look like hammered ass. I was trying to find that render. The rock? What rock? All right, enter, in we go. King wants to have an audience with us. He wants to see you right now, Squire. Mm. Better get in there, boy. The king is looking for you. <laughs> Not bad for a squire. Not bad at all. Better go talk to the king, kid. So they try to amp you up like the king's about to fucking, like, you know, rene re renege on your knighthood. But, like, they, they do a good job here. Is this the one? Yes, sir, this is the one. Oh, hey! <laughs> Forgot about that. <laughs> that fucking... Oh, I see. Oh, God, yeah, you're right. It is, it is the... Oh. A rare cutscene. For bravery befitting a defender of Meridel, and for the good of the kingdom, I do dub thee, sir. Sir. Well, spit it out, boy. What's your name? Tor. A uh, uh, Tormund, sir. Uh, or your majesty. Right then. That wasn't so hard, was it? <clears throat> sir Tormund, defender of the kingdom and knight of the realm. <laughs> Third class. Knight third hey, class. Knight third class. They can't even give Tormund first class. He has to have. He has to be fucking third, thir like third class. What are you waiting for? The rank of knight, knight second class? Well, you won't get standing here. You acted like a real knight today, and you deserve every bit of your reward. Thank you, Sir Tor, Master Torek. 
Good job, Ag Ag Kogam. You deserve that knighthood. Mm. Well, you've got more potential than I apparently gave you credit for. Yeah! Yeah, I fucking do! The only bastard in full plate mail. Yeah, go fuck yourself, Grayson. Alright. Congratulations, knight. Now get some sleep. That's not how you kneel for knighting? No, it's not. A rare second cutscene! A messenger from Illison. What does that fern covered forest fairy want now? King Scarl, I come to report that the glade is under attack. Illison needs the help of Meridel. What? Who would dare attack Illison? Um, it's the Werelook King, Your Majesty. Where? The Werelook King? The last time he moved against her, she turned him into a doggle fox for an entire month! <laughs> Guards, take this lying little no-name and throw him into the moat. Just throw him into the moat? Wait! Illison hasn't been herself lately. She's been secluded inside the glade and few have seen her. Dark clouds have gathered above her trees. You must have seen them. It's true, my lord. We've seen such clouds as he describes. We assume that it was Illison's work. Hmm. She's not known for doing any dark conjurations, which makes this disturbing news indeed. Right then. You heard the man. Knights of Meridel, let's ride! Thank you, my lord. And I love how Tor immediately fucking goes to like, he has two lazy eyes, you're telling me. Uh. Hold it, young knight. You're not coming with us now. <gasps> But I saved Gogam! And that's enough heroics for one day. That's why there's more than one night in the castle. Mm. Go get some sleep, Tor. Let us handle this, this battle. I like that there's it's they actually are like kinda treating it like realistically. It's like, bruh, you just fucking saved one town. You must be fucking exhausted. Go to bed. <laughs> You know it'd be hilarious if you could actually go to Cogham now and like change how the entire game goes from here. Because it's because Tor stays behind that um, the rest of the game happens. Alright, that's the sword smithy. We don't want that. We want the armorer. So we can get this stupid fucking armor upgrade they don't tell you. Like, did at any point they didn't fucking tell you that this is here. It's bullshit. Got the best armor in the kingdom. Come here and tell Igna what you need. See? They don't tell you about this shit! Go get some sleep before you get your ass kicked. Quite literally, yeah. Now I'm starting to look like a knight. This plate mail is some really sturdy stuff. Alright, so, um... We went from chainmail and a surcoat to... I'll actually break this down real quick. So, most knights, um... They get either plate or um, gambeset. Okay, sorry. So basically, uh, most knights they get either plate or they get chainmail on top of brigandine. That's what it is. So Tor is a third class knight, so he doesn't get a full suit of armor. He does get plate mail, riveted chainmail, and a proper pair of leather gloves. More than likely, there's leather and chainmail underneath those gloves. And if you look at his boots, those are actually rimmed with metal, so those are probably meant for like on the trail boots. Because the bottoms of the of them are like either because they're not the same leather as the thing, so it's probably rimmed with like a either something or like a resin or something. Eh, can't speak. But yeah, so this is like what you're supposed to look like. And on my honor, I never really realized that you're supposed to look like this for like a while. It always pissed me off as a kid to know that I missed that for like the longest time. All right, save. Because the game likes to crash here. In we go. I'm probably just gonna throw in a pizza tonight. 
Uh, I need to cook. I need to eat. Jesse! Jesse, we need to cook! We need to go to Freddy Fazbear's, Jesse! 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 Use a full main or Mercury on Foxy, Jesse! Jesse, you're using too much power! Fuck. Now go to sleep. Cutscene? Oh, yeah. I forgot about this. <laughs> Was that the plot? <laughs> Maybe someone in the castle asked some advice. Stop. SM, no, you can't. You gotta have more respect hmm. for yourself. None of the knights returned from Ilsen's Glade yet. I forget who you have to talk to to, um, like, trigger the next part of the quest. Hmm. Oh, old knight. Hiya. Hello again, sir. Hmm. I am troubled. The knights have not returned from their mission in Ilsen's hmm. Glade. The impressive purple clouds still fill the skies over hmm. the forest. I sense dark magics growing stronger with each passing hour. Hmm. Torment, I fear that the knights are in grave danger. The entire kingdom may be in peril. If you do not go there aid at hmm. once. Yes, sir, but how do you know this? Who are... We haven't the time to discuss this. You must go to Ilsen's Glade and aid your fellow knights immediately. Aww. I'll be there with you and can help you when I can. Now go. Hmm. What if you wave? Because the thing about, like, all the NPCs in this game, a bunch of them wave for, like, no reason. It's actually really kind of funny. I, I, I wonder if we can get King Scarl to wave real quick. Hang on a second. Yeah, never mind. Alright, so now that we are all upgraded, we can head over to Ilsen's Glade. Please don't crash. I, I, I just realized I didn't say, please don't crash. Oh, thank God. <laughs> My old PS2 might be a little dusty, but I do worry about this game crashing. I'm not even gonna lie, chat. Alright. Save game before... Every time the game pauses for, like, a little bit longer than normal, I'm always just like, please, please tell me you're not gonna crash. Alright. That should keep us safe for at least a little bit. So... We're all set in upgrades... How much cash do I have? Basically nothing. All right, that's fine. We won't need to actually um, use anything. How's my emotes doing? All right, better than nothing. When the Smash tournament happens, can we have a Discord channel where we just hop on it and when we have it? I'm probably going to like set up like you know, we're setting stuff up for that. Don't worry. We're we're I'm, I'm still in talks about. You know, if I actually want to do that, because the channel might be at 500 subscribers, we're not big enough to have a wide branch of thing. And besides, we're making a proper tournament with like actual prizes and stuff. You know what I mean? Well, a prize for the first place winner, but we're chipping in for that. We're trying to figure out what we want to do with it, really. I'm still trying to organize a final boss too, because um, I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can't beg a few a few YouTubers to help us here. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, um, I'm going to ask. I doubt he will, I fucking doubt for a fact he will say yes. Like, I sincerely doubt it. Fuck the music bugged again. Oh, so I don't just get to roll over the lobbies? Dang it. No, David, you're not allowed to roll over everyone. <laughs> as much as I know you would like. All right, we have to reset again because the music's cut out and that means the game's going to crash soon. Fucking hell. <sighs> Reset. It's actually super nice to just have a fucking console I can just smash the reset button on. 
I'm probably gonna lose, but I don't care as long as I have fun. Yeah. Probably like fighting Snake and Bayonetta. David, you can't only use Snake. Remember Subspace Emissary Tournament. You can't use. You can only use people that that showed up in Brawl. So you can use Snake, but no DLC characters. Only only Brawl characters is what we're titling it. The Subspace Emissary Brawl Tournament is what we're calling it. Or just the Subspace Emissary Tournament. That's why I need a final boss, because someone needs to be playing the part of Taboo. That is how I'm going to do it? Yeah. Another idea I had is um, this cool idea. So basically, so you know how in Subspace Emissary, in the story mode, they give you the characters on the character screen, and then it's like, you know... To, to pick which stocks they are. I had an idea where we would do that. So your stocks were all different characters. So like they'd be they'd be they'd be tournaments of it'd be a tournament of ones, and it'd be like best to four. So basically, it's best to four stock, and each stock is a different character. So like you do ones, and someone would be playing one character, another character. And you'd have to fight through their stocks at the different characters. I thought it would be a cool idea. And it would also keep people from doing one-trick shit. You know what I mean? That would be interesting, but a lot of time between lobbies. Well, yeah, but that's kind of the point. If we're, if we're going to be doing this, we're going to be doing this, like, cool. You know what I mean? If not, I'm sure we can work something out. Like, um... I'm sure there's a setting or something we can fuck around with to figure that out. You know what I mean? Now, which way am I going here? Meridel, Bright Vale, Kills is laid. Ooh, like a team battle? Something like that. We'll figure it out. Like I said, it's still in the works, but I promise you guys a Smash tournament will do it eventually. But like I said, I need to find a final boss first. Now, as I was saying, I sincerely doubt with a passion this will ever happen. But I'm going to ask Alpha Rad if he can be our final boss. Like I said, I sincerely doubt he'll fucking give me the time of day or anything. But like I said, I'm still going to give it a shot. I'm also probably going to ask King of Skill and a few other people, like, if they want to, like, do this, but, you know, who knows. Wow. Alright, we got Stripey Neg, we got Golden Neg, can't afford that. A Silver Neg, can't afford that. Speckled Neg. I may be young, but I have a good memory. Yeah, we can afford a Speckled Neg, we'll buy one. Eh, fuck it, we'll need a few of these, why not? We'll buy a few. Yeah, fuck it, we're not buying anything else for a while. Screw it. That'll keep me safe for a boss battle. Uh, which one? The one referring to the helmets or the, the fallout thing? Because I have an idea for fall. I, I was going to talk to you about that after stream, David. Like, I guess I can tell you now because you're here. Um, I was going to actually do, um, like a specific, like, video style for the review. Like, I have something in mind, so I'm not going to do a round table. If we can get, like, a few more people together, we can probably do, like, um, something for, like, a Fallout round table. But first, I want to actually, like, actually do a proper review of it. Genuinely shocked how good that game is. Fuck! Oh, that fucking sketchy dude. That fucker has a to treasure in Illison's Glade. Meridel is so far away! We're not gonna we're not gonna be able to talk to him. Uh, I don't wanna go 
fuck? We just say we just saved here in Ilson's Glade. We gotta fucking walk all the way back to Meridel. We don't even have the money for the maps. Fuck it. I just realized. Oh man, I almost just fucked myself there. Can you imagine if I walked all the way back and realized I didn't have the money for it? I realized I just spent all my money on the fucking the fucking eggs. Jesus, close one. Bro spent it all anyways. Exactly. War loops. Alright. Oh, shit. These guys are weak to water. Shout them out. Bastards. Why are they weak to... I don't know. Hang on. Let's see here. Light modes are so fucking rare, dude. Not gonna lie, I can't wait for summer. Bro, I'm I, I I there's a fucking um Yeah, these guys are weak to light it seems. Also, the more luck you have, the better that um returns you get on those um Dude, I'm being honest, like, if they remade this game, like, for modern day things, this game would do gangbusters. Like, I ain't even fucking lying, dude. This game would, like, do so well if they remade it in today's, like, you know, modern engines. Can you imagine this game with a fucking, like, lock-on mechanics and actual proper, like, world building and a fast travel? It'd be good. What was bro about to say about summer? Oh, um, I am I'm learning how to smoke meats this summer. Out of the way, out. What the fuck? The fire, that's what they are. So it would be water. I about to, thought you were about to say weed. Or EA would make it. Oh, God. Fuck no. There you go. Supernova Moat. Halo of Rainbow God. Anyways. So yeah, I'm gonna learn how to smoke uh, meats this this summer and smoke cheeses. I'm making some fucking smoke provolone out this bitch. I would rather die than may play a game made by EA, except for Plants vs Zombies 2. Plants vs Zombies 2 is good. See, we're starting to find um more moats from fallen enemies. That's because our luck is so high. I think our luck is actually as high as it can go right now. Smoke Gouda. Oh, dude, smoke Gouda. I can't fucking wait to, to get the smoker built this, this summer. Meat, meat and cheese smoking stream when I'm already beaten to one of you fuckers to saying it because I know one of you guys were about to say it. And my answer is I don't fucking know if I'm even going to be capable of doing that. Master Torak! <laughs> Instead of standing there, uh, standing around, why don't you smash the lock and let me out? That's what I was doing, Torag. Free the others. I'll protect the lift. Alright, we gotta find three knights. 
oil upstream when? What the fuck does oil up mean? Dude, I can't wait to get to like some smoked sharp, like aged age sharp cheddar. Ow, you fucker! These guys are dropping a lot of shadow modes. Alright, that's the lift. So, not that way. Got it. And of course, they don't fucking tell you where they are. Oh, safe spot. Don't want this game crashing on me. Oh god, I'm not explaining it to him. Probably for the best, then. Alrighty. Fuck! And he's dead. Don't look at me, I'm not a zoomer, so I got nothing, and god, am I going... Am I not googling that? Yeah, same here. Darneg. Deez would probably explain it. Yeah, where is Deez anyways? He's usually here for these streams. <laughs> Five seconds later, I have arrived! Ugh, I've been pining for today. Today I can finally eat something other than chicken and rice. Good job, Tor. Damn! What's this lock made out of? He was here for the beginning? Was he? I didn't even realize. Alright, so that's two more knights we gotta find. Yep. God, these starberry bushes basically drop nothing. He was here before me? Huh. Probably probably had to had dinner or homework or something. I do have to remind myself that a lot of you guys are like young young. After all, I am grandpa gamer. Or gamer grandpa. Fuck! The Alzheimer's is taking it's taking root. Ooh, wow, that was up! Can't tell that's a darkness or shadow mode. That's a shadow mode. Darkness is all goopy and shit. Bro, I was there before Minecraft. <sighs> I know this will sound crazy, but dude, I was literally there when Minecraft like hit the scene, man. Like, I ain't gonna lie, dude. I was there and I witnessed Minecraft boom. <laughs> Oh no, crap, I forgot to donate to the Alzheimer's. I'm still trying to figure out what all y'all kids are still doing on my lawn. Exactly. There you are. Alright, um... Yeah, thanks, map. I'll eat one of these. I fucking bought them. I might as well use them. Oh, it's a burning house! Would you rather have a gun or a woman? What caliber is the gun? And how old is the woman? These are key questions you have to ask when you're presented with something like this, chat. Ooh.
A gun or a woman? Yeah, those are good questions. Exactly. Exactly. Those are good questions to ask when presented with that. Because you could give me a fucking Torres or something, or like a high point, and be like, well, you wanted the gun. And it's like, I didn't want a fucking high point. And then I'd shoot you with the high point, and the high point would explode in my hand, and I wouldn't fucking have a gun anymore. I would just die because the high point killed me. Uh, where is this last motherfucker? I always- I remember as a kid I always got stuck here too. I can never remember where the last one was. Forty-five ACP, exactly. Devil went to Georgia, but he didn't stick around. This is God's caliber. Gunshot noises mixed with drums. I like how bro hesitated. Hesitated on what? What fucking enemy is seeing me? You say as your pistols, the pistols nine millimeter. Well, yeah, because nine millimeter is cheap, David. I'm not gonna spend an extra fucking eighty dollars per box because I just want forty-five ACP. Oh, David, you're gonna lose your shit when I tell you this. So I was at this new gun shop that um, they've been open for a while, but I finally got around to them, and I was just taking a look around their stuff. They had a bunch of old and wacky stuff. I'm like, okay, this place is pretty cool. I hear the click of a, of, of a um of a slide going forward. I turn around. And I see this old man loading a fucking round into the chamber manually, and I'm like, I am out of here. Like, Jesus Christ! I am like, I am out of this fucking place. <laughs> what fucking freaked me out is that he he fucking racks it like right out of, I hear it rack as I'm leaving I'm like yeah I'm out I'm out I ain't fucking staying here I am like you you want you want you where the fuck is this last guy Ugh, fucking losing my mind here okay obviously he's not over here I'm gonna go check the previous area Nope, 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 nope. Exactly. Exactly. It's just, it's just, it's just shit like that, man. You can't, you can't fucking expect me to not just bounce immediately. Yeah, yeah, that was the same story I told last time, but I didn't tell David that story yet. I was gonna tell him to, like, um, Tuesday at D&D, &D, but I figured he's here now, so I might as well tell him. I actually don't know where the fuck this third guy is. It's freaking me out. Fuck me. Not that way either. I am losing my mind right now. I have no idea where this guy is. Fuck. Oh, God. All that frustration from a kid is starting to... From when I was a kid is starting to come back. Just like, ah! Uh, I, I know where the first one and second one are. I don't ever remember where the third one is. 
You fuckers have a peace talk between the Goblin Mafia and the Pirates to deal with first before you guys can do any combat. Things that make sense in D&D context but don't make sense in normal talk context. I would join D&D. &D. Yeah, I'm I'm not um this is going to sound really bad, but I'm not going to do D&D &D with fans. I'm going to make that a member thing. So like once a week I'm going to do like member D&D &D, like sessions essentially. I want to do more DMing, but like, uh, I figure I'm gonna like, have that be like a members thing or like a Patreon thing. Once I finally get to the place where I can actually have that. Where? I'm losing my marbles! You know, fuck it. What's the name of this fucker I'm looking for? Okay. Jesus Christ, it's the first fucking thing that comes up. Okay, we found him. Alright. Jesus Christ. No wonder I missed him. Okay, so... We got that one. Oh, fuck off! Jesus, I, l I literally just felt that in my soul right there. I literally just like, oh right, he's in this stupid... Because the full... Because if you're coming from this direction, that doesn't look like a cave. It just looks like part of the scenery. Alright, let's go, let's go finish this act. So I was right, we are going to get to the next act tonight. Which means a lot of grinding for me. Because there is a secret place and, oh god, I just realized that's going to be so much fucking grinding. Alright. Doesn't even fucking close the doors for me, the bastard. Alright, so now we're in the treetops of Illison's Glade. Fair enough, I'm not using Patreon. I use Patreon, but not for many people. Also, Chan would kill me if I sent them money on Patreon, lol. Well, Patreon is different, David, because Patreon is limits how much money you could give me. You know what I mean? This man fucking threatened to give me a thousand dollars and I just about murdered him. Bitch. Yeah, throw another one. Do it again. Idiot. Yeah, it's always- I always feel weird when my friends give me- when tr friends try to give me things. I always feel weird about it. Got it. Rob- Robin- Robin- their fade for their money. 
all they're worth. Not exactly. We met back in... David, what was it? 2017 we met? Yeah, yeah, that was when I started that job. and Yeah, yeah, it was 2017 we met. And we also met Red at the same time. So me, Red, and David have been best friends since um, 2017. Oh, yeah, it was 2016, wasn't it? Ugh, how much further? So, we're about to come up on a really hard scene. And I mean hard. Like, as a kid, I never expected this game to, like, fucking accelerate to um to what it what it does here this is fucking nuts what happens here watch this shit get away from her this is the best meridel has to offer you're barely a mouthful i said get away i don't have time for this Narpus. Two bones. Yes, you have to fight fucking... You have to fight a fucking monster. Ah! Shit! Fuck! I wasn't ready, you bastard! I don't remember how... Oh, wait. I remember how to fight him now. Oh, there he goes. Ow! He's the alien from Ben 10. Forearms. Ow! Ow! Oh, I thought the game crashed for a second. Backhanded! <laughs> We must leave quickly before <laughs> you more than most. He's no dead, by the way. On your back on your enemy. No! Narvis, quit playing with your food and kill him. He just got fucking murdered, by the way. Yes, he was just stabbed in the back and murdered, and we watched. We could do nothing but watch. Damn it! Nervous, stop that! Tor, lock on, damn it! Luckily, Narfus is so big that you can actually hit him twice, technically. Got him! Frozen, bitch! Torlock on, please. Got him. There he goes. <laughs> I 
I love how offended Ilsen looks. She's not even, she's not upset, she's not screaming. She's like, bitch took my necklace. Breath of the Wild would go lock, lock on, would go crazy in this game. Absolutely. This is before lock ons were, actually, no, this is way after fucking Ocarina of Time. Been fighting, fighting. My lady, what happened? Since she came back, I sensed her power. So dark, so strong. Never felt anything so strong. Who, my lady? Listen to me. Her hate is so deep. She'll take us all, all the berries, and send us to a black sleep from which we can never awaken. Only by Chung. Oh no! No! She's won! She's won, and there's nothing. You must stop her. Putting the fairies to sleep is only the beginning. You must warn No, me don't her. kiss. Please she don't. Must... This isn't Sonic 06. You don't have to freak out. <laughs> Tor fucking eats it. You had a good sleep there, pumpkin. You awake. Thank God, I was just about to make a Sonic joke too. So, welcome to the end of Act 1. The the literal fucking... That minion archer is also fire... Oh, that one. I was about to say, there's nothing on screen. So, fire mode should have the same alignment. So... Here's the thing, the apocalypse is happening. It's happening at the end of act one. I am not fucking joking when I say the apocalypse is happening as I speak. That was only act one? Yeah, we're not even done with act one yet. So we need to fucking leave. Um, I have 200, 100. I wish I had more, more like Nova and Rainbow shit. Um, that's not good. Okay, um... So yeah, so basically, oh fuck. So basically, if um you killed too many Dar Daragax in that quest, which I didn't, I didn't start, so it wasn't counting, more of those guys spawn, and I mean a lot. There can be up to seven to eight on screen at one time, but now only three to four should spawn at a time. But yeah, it gets mad fucked later in the game if you kill too many Daragax. So, yeah, welcome to the end of Act 1. The apocalypse has started. Pokemon. It's not even It's not even a fucking contest. Pokemon win. It doesn't matter if you go by game logic or real world logic or anime logic. The lions fucking lose. You can take out probably, I don't know, fucking... Probably a half of them just by... Okay, even if you use game logic, just by the sheer number of Pokemon that using Earthquake at the same time, they all lose. Yeah, people are just fucking stupid. Lion, lions, lions lose that. It, it's so easy. Okay, you, you, okay, you bring me every Pokemon that can use Earthquake. You line them up. You have them all use Earthquake at the same time. Lions lose. That's it. You even like you can do that with fucking um. You can even do that with fucking the Pokemon that know Solar Beam or Hyper Beam. They all fucking lose. Even by going and going with game logic, even separate PPs and all that shit. There, there's so many Pokemon at this rate that it's not even funny. You know what I mean? That's it. That's it. They. That's just how it is. Every Pokemon that can use Flamethrower uses Flamethrower. That's exactly it too. Bro, Blastoise can punch holes through steel with those fucking water guns. They're not winning. They're lions. Arceus is a god. Palkia and Dialga are a god. D fucking Pal Dialga can just turn back time to the point where the lions would just never win. Exactly, exactly. Legendary Pokemon. Even, okay, even excluding legendary Pokemon, Pokemon still win! Yeah. 
And, oh yeah, you have to fucking nerf Pokemon to try and even give the Lions a sort of chance that they still lose. Like, exclude legendary Pokemon, they still lose. Now, if you say a billion Lions versus Gen 1, get, with the game rules, that they might win. They might win that, you know what I mean? Just because of the sheer number of Lions. But that's against Gen 1 and Gen 1 only. And even then, I still imagine they'd kill a lot of the Lions. Like, they'd probably kill 75% of the Lions. Still lose because of Gengar? Not wrong. I was thinking more of Mew and Mewtwo. Oh, shit! So you see how there's only one chasing me right now? So like, hang on, where are you? Are you still here? Bastard. Fucker! Got him. I got fucking cursed. Zeroar would just kill every line with how fast lightning cat the cat is. Exactly. It's like that fucking image. I was like, oh, which which animals would you like to defend you from all the other animals? You take the you take the the you take the twenty thousand rats and the, the the thousand crows because that's like that's a hundred crows and like two hundred rats for every single animal. No animal is fucking fighting off. 300, like, or, or sorry, 200 rats and 100 crows. Fuck yourself. Easy. Oh, shit. Ow! All right, we're back to the castle. Apocalypse is over. We're, we're safe now. No, we're not. Because the wicked bitch of the east is here. Dark Knights! Lucky to keep the camera on me. Ah, he kicked me. There's another one. can send every every line to the shadow realm damn it Oh boy. Porygon given lion seizures. I'd like to mention, by the way, I saw the fucking episode. I did see the episode, guys, of um, Porygon has finally made an appearance in the TV show again. They finally restricted his band, and I am so happy. Porygon finally got justed. Years, you say. And they completely forgot me. Oh uh, yeah, I forgot well, with the fucking now, Hex sisters over here. Do. And I suppose I should remedy that. 
conquering this fly speck of a kingdom was easy enough, but I need something a little bigger to announce my return. Oh, I know. I'll destroy it completely. That should get their attention. And I know just the weapon to use to flatten the place. Two birds with one stone. <laughs> oh, yes. That would do wonderfully. That's why play Bale gives you disadvantage on stealth. Poor fucking dead. No, he's good. He doesn't appear to be under my control. How unusual. Kill him, but bring me what's left of the body when you're done. Of course, dear sister. It's about time we had some amusement. Yeah, the fucking hex sisters <gasps> over here. <laughs> Alright. So yes, yeah, so we have to run away from the goth fairies now. Hot hot topic threw up all over them. God. Alright, um fuck. I don't remember how to actually do this boss! Nope! Okay, let's bail! Oh shit! Oh god. Yeah! Oh god! Can't hurt him. Ow! Oh, now I remember how to do this. Look at you, chill! Look at you, I can't see! Cool, that's our ticket out of here. Ow! Uh. Tor! Oh, I see. Not the right way, Tor! Oh, yeah, right way. Never mind. Can't get out that way. Fuck, that one almost killed me. Gotta get out of here. Gotta get out of here. Ah, there's my ticket. Ugh. The kitchens are on fire. Dead end. Over here, young master. This chute leads to the moat. You can escape and warn the others. Where could he have gone? Aha! A rubbish shoot. Ew! I'm not going in there. We'll just have to flush him out! <laughs> Oh shit! Ah! <laughs> uh. Oh, thank God I cleaned this fucking place out. I always feel bad for Tor. Oh God, I forgot about this. So yeah, the the kingdom's dead. Your family might fucking be dead. Welcome to the Barbie Castle. <laughs> Like, bro, what the fuck? I hate doing these things. Yet still, they must be done. 
I fucking hate this stupid game. It wasn't cut out to be a diplomat, Saradar. <laughs> so I forgot to install proper safety Done protocols. What the fuck? Teams. Goofy ass it's intro to the, the Barbie movie. <laughs> Bro exploded. We shouldn't be long, Salarin. They hope. <sighs> I have learned the basic spells in secret. I promise to keep my silence if you will teach me more. You have a natural gift for magic. But as royal sorcerer, I know only too well that the responsibilities of magic and diplomacy are mutually exclusive. If they weren't, I would be the diplomat here and you would be the sorcerer. But... The mission is most important. Your uncle and I have never seen such clouds as those that gather over Meridel. They are dark things and full of power. Our meeting with Queen Fiora must go well, and that responsibility falls to you. Yes, sir. I'll do my best. You do fine, Roberta. And if it helps any, maybe I'll teach you some more complicated spells while we're here. Really? Just one or two. But now we must hurry. It's getting late, and I'm sure Queen Fiora will want to meet with Don't us tell soon. me you have to play as a woman. I want to see... Yeah. Yeah. Well, Act 2 is all about Roberta. So this is Roberta. She is um, daughter of the King of Brightvale, and she is a diplomat who wants to be a sorcerer. But she is stuck being a diplomat. Tor might be dead for all we know. And now you're here at the fucking Barbie castle. Doing fucking things. I, when I played this game for the first time. I was pissed. Dude. I was so unbelievably fucking mad. I was like what is this garbage. Alright. Yes this whole chapter is about Roberta. Thankfully. This chapter is short. It's like the shortest chapter in the whole fucking game. Act 2 is like the shortest act in the whole game. Because basically, like, they spent the whole time tutorializing you. So now you're good to whatever. Alright, so I need that stone. I need to find some other bullshit. Like, if you gun through it, it can be like 30-40 minutes. It's not long. Like this this is like like I said, this is the this is the shortest chapter in the whole game. Thank you. What's more fucked? The fact that I remember there's goodies in the maze, or the fact that like I st I, I strategically went to the, the maze initially and like, oh yeah, there's shit in here. Alright, and then I need you. Um do I have any jeppies? Yes I do. Yeah, be more for more tour in like an hour. Oh, we're not getting to tour. We're not gonna see him for a while. Because there is a secret shop here that requires, I think it's like 8,000 Neo points to do. So, like, um, if you actually get all the Neo points you need, you can actually get like all the end game stuff for Roberto right away. And that way you don't have to ever buy anything for her ever again. The only problem is that it requires a lot of grinding and Roberta it takes a while, and it's bullshit, but it's um, not too hard. So, I need to grab this guy when I get the... I need to go talk to the painter, and have him make his stupid fucking invisible paint. Then he'll paint the tower, it'll disappear. I can bring the pet pet with me, the tower will reappear. Then I could... Like I said, I spent way too much fucking time with this game as a kid. Oh, wow, I don't think we ever fucking... Um, Went to, um... Yeah, I don't think we ever went to the potion shop, um... As, as Tor. So yeah, we get to play as Twi'lek Girl for a while. Still somehow better than the Ahsoka series. Greetings, Counselor Kiku. I am Roberta, yada yada. We are emissaries. Yeah, terrible dark cloud. All right, in session. Please wait. All right.
Well, if we have to wait, I'm going to make use of my time at the palace library. Such a delight of learning and so many wondrous books. You see, I've lost my Harris. He seems to be in a tree and I'm afraid to. Alright, now then. Still somehow better than the Ahsoka series. Actually, you know what? Replace replace the wands with blasters and replace the swords with lightsabers. Literally better than the Ahsoka series in Mandalorian. Easy. I'm not even fucking kidding. God, I've been I've been trying not to make a fucking rant video about Star Wars, but I feel like doing the the fucking um the Fallout series review is gonna make me do that. Mando season three is absolutely not fucking better than that. I think it's fairy dust. Ahsoka, Ahsoka, okay, I give you that. Well, yeah, Ahsoka sucks. Shock. Yeah, for real. I actually don't remember how the fuck to get up to that tree. I'm being honest. Let's go. Let's go get the wand real quick. Actually, no, we have to get the. I think we have to get the thing first. Oh, now I remember. Okay. David, stop coping. Mando season three was garbage, and let's not pretend it wasn't. Or I'm sorry, I'm sorry, not Mando season three, the Bo-Katan show. Ah, no, 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 Roberta, Roberta, no, no, Roberta, you bitch! How fucking dare you? Seriously, that bullshit with Bo-Katan wasn't even fun. I'm going to make- I'm going to commit tax evasion! Copium non-existent, he's being serious, I'm on his side. I don't know, man. I- I gave up on season three after we spent a whole fucking episode focusing on that dude from season one. Like, that part character from season one that was like, serving Krennic or whatever the fuck. Just like- what are we doing here? Like, I thought we- I thought we were supposed to be on an adventure with Mando, not fucking... Okay, season three is broken into two parts. The first part with pirates is a good one, and the Bo-Katan part is kind of meh. I don't know. I am done. I'm fucking done with- with just Star Wars in general. They can suck my ass. And they can miss me with that fucking subscription program to fucking play Outlaws. Like, what are you on? They are determined to murder Star Wars. Baby Yoda is my favorite character. I guess. I'm not gonna yuck someone's yum. If they love it, they love it. You know what I mean? But understand where I'm coming from. I had to watch Star Wars die. We all had to watch Star Wars die. Yo, bitch, I want to learn magic. That was supposed to be after the council meeting. But we do have some time now. I suppose you do have a point. Now is a good time as any. So then, did you bring your training wand with you? Oh, no, I left it in the back of... Left it back in Brightvale. Then I have the perfect training aid for you. You'll have to build a wand for to use. Should be able to find all the ingredients you need for a wand here in Fairyland. I'll be here reading once you found them. All right. Star Wars fell into the hellhole after the remakes. They're not remakes, they're shitty sequels.
don't remember the names. That's how bad they are. Well, the first one was... What the fuck was the name of the first movie? What was the name of the first shitty re the, 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 the sequel trilogy? What the fuck was the name of it? was the name of that first movie. Force Awakens! That's what it was. Force Awakens. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Fucking Shepard. Jesus Christ. Shepard with the saves tonight. Jesus Christ. Weird, but it feels like Fiora's from the endless staircase out of order. Doors locked too. Shit, wrong way. Where the fuck is the exit? Mm hmm. Okay, so we got the power source. Now we just need to find the stick and the other thing. I saw Force Awakens, Empire Seeks Droid, Harboring, Weak Point of Plant Destroyer. Huh, I've done this already. Exactly. Bro, I grew up watching that that too, man. I I my dad took me out of school. Based dad moment, guys, by the way. Based dad moment. My dad took me out of school so we could watch the third episode in theaters. That's how based my dad is. He's like, you ain't going to school for this shit. So I was in school, and then my dad takes me out of school, and he's like, yeah, an appointment or something. Yep, fucking base dad. Sarlacc? Yeah. They have a weird breeding cycle. Sarlaccs do. Because they spit up, um, base dad. I always thought the Mandalorians were, like, the coolest faction, so, too. Yeah, when they're being portrayed right. And when we're not romanticizing them like the fucking, like, they're the fucking Roman Empire. Got the fairy dust. I love how those are, um, the graphics are, um, done wrong. They show you the full bottle and then they show you the empty bottle. Yeah, until they weren't SM. A a Roman Empire died, just like Kaiser's Legion. I'm sorry, Caesar's Legion. Let's not forget, let's not forget, folks, that fucking, um, like, Mandalorians lost two wars. The wars against the Jedi, and they lost against the fucking Empire. Just like Rome. Just like Rome. <laughs> they did die just like my mental health. Then you have fucking Roberta's O face here, just like, ah! God. Oh, I fucking hate that I remember so much from this stupid fucking game. <laughs> Alright, we got the power source. We need, um... Oh god, that's right. Roberta doesn't have any moats. Oh, hang on. Yep! Twelve leaf clover. Bring on the luck. 
Yes, alright, we're at level 3 luck. Perfect. So that'll give us a little bit more money from the golden grass. Make grinding a lot easier for us anyways. I'm still looking for that fucking stick. <gasps> Door's locked. Not gonna lie, Chan, your voice is soothing as shit. I don't believe you! I don't believe you! I, I don't I don't believe that for a second, but I appreciate it. Okay, they lost the Jedi sort of, but the Empire was simply pulling in America. Exactly. Okay. I appreciate that, SM. That's very polite of you to say. I don't I can't find this fucking stick for the life of me. I, I need the I need the handle last. That's all I need is this freaking handle. Meow Klops likes the purple ones, I think. Oh, I see what you mean. Unless bro is screaming, then it's soothing. Okay, I'm so I see what you mean now. Have this. Now we have this pet pet. Crap, I think it's actually um the stick is in in one of these, I think. Damn it, it's not here. Time for bed for me. Good night. You have a good night, SM. I'll see you. I'll see you tomorrow for the Bloodborne stream. <sighs> I kind of don't want to play Bloodborne anymore. If I'm being honest, I started. I started that series in earnest, and now I'm just kind of like thinking about all the rest of the bull crap I have to go through to finish that game. But I want. I want to make a series out of it. So I or I want to make a video out of it. So I'm gonna have to fucking get to the brass tacks and finish it eventually. So I'm gonna just power through it, hopefully. I'm probably gonna make it an overtime stream. You know what I mean? Where is this fucking stick? Alright, I'll see you in a, I'll see you in a bit, David. Oh, I'm gonna fucking lose it. I'm looking for this goddamn stick and it's nowhere. Do I have to climb the tree again? Is that what it is? Yeah, the cat has to be in range of the tower so we can unlock the secret shop. I think that the stick might actually still be up in the tree. I'm not lying. Also, props to Roberta. Despite being a princess, she can freaking climb like a champion. Please. We got the we got the fucking thing here. I actually don't know where the where the stick is supposed to be. I'm losing my mind here. Ugh, I guess I don't know this game as good as I thought. Where the fuck is a st Damn it. Oh, I'm losing my mind.
Okay, maybe it is on the other side. Maybe I just missed it. Secret shop. All right, we've unlocked the secret shop. Let's take a look. Vorsh, the fucking ghost. So you have a golden shield, a silver neg, a sorcerer's wand, fairy robes. Golden Neg, Kavar's Potion, and then you have other shit up on top. Hey, Stugles. Um, is this the store? Yeah, this is the, this is the secret shop. So, basically, you need a shit ton and I mean a shit ton of neopoins like in total oh god it's more than I even remember so you need 8,000 for the dress and 7,000 for the wand and then Tor actually has an upgrade in here as well so yeah okay so now that that's unlocked I'll just be there from now on I'm still looking for this godforsaken stick I'm losing my mind right now Ah! Aha! Here we go. It must be up here at the top of the tree. Alright, um, we can grab the wand and we'll probably end after I build the wand and show it off a little bit because it is two hours into tonight's stream and I still want to cook and eat for myself tonight. Very wood stick. This would make a fine handle for a wand. Yeah, we're not going to be using this for long because I'm going to grind out and get that sorcerer's wand. So, here's the bullshit. There is some golden grass in this area that you can infinitely farm. So that's how you can get the money for all the things in the shop. However, I timed this out when I was a kid. It takes a long time. A long fucking time. But you can do it. It's something like, I think the thing gives you like 400 a pop or like 300 a pop or something. So, it, but the problem is that the, the grass takes like five to seven minutes to, re, to recuperate. So, in total, you're spending like three to four hours per item, if not more. <laughs> Alright. Hmm. We have a wand now. Hmm. Hmm. We have a wand. I see you have constructed a new lightsaber. I mean wand. Well done. Now that you know you can channel the edge, let's try hitting something. Mm. Alright, now let's fuck up that book. The aiming is so fucked in this thing. <laughs> Let's try to channel your power into a rapid burst. Bastard! 
take this outfit as a reward for all your hard studying. You've earned it. Yes, we have mage robes now. Hmm. Alright, let's go finish our task with King Fiora. Yep, shut up, don't care. Probably shouldn't have skipped that. Um, uh, uh, shit, I just realized I probably definitely shouldn't have skipped that. Basically, fucking shit's fucked. Um, uh, we gotta go figure out what's happening. Dark clouds, darkest fairy might be back. Who's the darkest fairy? I don't fucking know. Um, but, or I shouldn't tell you guys, but you guys should be afraid of her. If she gets up here, we're fucked. Oh, well, it's a good thing she's, she can't get up here, right? It's a good thing she can't get up here, right? It's a good thing she can't get up here, right? Fuck, 75? That's gonna take forever to grind out. 75? Guys, I hate to say it, but we're not, I, I ain't, we ain't got time for that. Fuck that. That's gonna take so long. That's not even reasonable. <laughs> I, I I remember getting way more from those coins than that. What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my lord. You've got to be kidding me. Hang on. I need to fucking see that again. No way it's that little. Also, this stuff recovers, like, a lot faster than I thought it would. Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, okay. 120. There we go. So this is doable. Okay, okay, okay. 320. 320. Okay. Chat, I need your honest opinion. Do we grind or do we fucking just like leave? Do we just say fuck it? That's that's the real question here, chat. Is do we say fuck it or do we do we just? Cause I don't know, I don't know. Fuck. Cause we can just end stream right here, and that could be it. And then we can finish up this act later, or we can just finish this act up tonight. Like, I don't know what to do here, because I could grind out for the Sorcerer's Wand, and then, like, Roberta's good. Roberta doesn't need to buy any other sor Sorcerer staff if we grind for that. But this is going to take so fucking long, I don't even want to do it. Like, seriously. You know what? This is an Elden Ring. Fuck this. We can get the money later. There's a better grinding spot in Bogshot anyways that gives you, like... 400 to 500 per go anyways. Fuck this. Get some sleep before you travel back to Brightvale. Yeah. Alright, let's save and get the fuck out of here. Actually, eh, I haven't streamed all week because I've been working on the fucking Fallout series video and the other videos and the shit post. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll finish this act up. I owe you guys a bit of overtime. I want to be a good Mr. Streamer now, don't I? Alright, let's see here. Thank God Roberta's chapter is so fucking short. Speaking of getting some sleep, I'm going to call it midnight here and work so on. Cheers, folks. Cheers, Shepard. Good to see you again. I'll see you on Monday. Or tomorrow, I guess. We're going to be... God, I don't want to play Bloodborne. But I have to I have to finish that fucking series if I want to make the damn video. So we have to play it. Alright. Me and Sugos will finish this act while you head out. Wow, 
wow, that is certainly a run cycle. That is most definitely some sort of run cycle. Oh my god. Then we get the room on the left, win mode, save game. All right, so. Crap. Oh well. We sleep. The darkest fairy then begins Apocalypse 2 Electric Boogaloo. Fucking doing her hair and shit. <gasps> Dearest Fiora. For more than a thousand years, I have waited for this moment. <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> Please don't ruin it by speaking. After all, I've had an awfully long time to plan this revenge. Just wait and see what I have in store for you. Yeah, we can just go back to sleep. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so... Oh, shit. Hang on. There's a secret cutscene in here you can miss if you don't come in here. Siridar? What's going on? Are you all right? It's all right, little one. Everything is fine now that the real power has returned. Your lessons in dark magic can finally begin. <laughs> So you can actually you can actually miss that cutscene if you don't visit him, but yeah. I am surprised that the game is glitching out like that. Okay. Ow! Oh god, I fucking remember this now. Gotta do a bunch of bullshit with turning the clock tower on and the other fucking garbage. Ow! Probably should have bought some things before I started the next act, but you know, screw it. So, my minions were right. Another one has resisted my power. Two now, in so short a time. What makes you and that young loop so special? Hmm. You look familiar, and yet... Why does it move no, like that? it's not possible. A thousand years have passed. I don't know, man. Besides, it doesn't matter who you are. I have so many wonderful ways of finding out where your precious defense comes from. Let's try them all, why don't we? It's time for casual torture. <laughs> damn! Damn, she took the CVT machine from the Cult of Root Beer! Oh, God! 
That woman has mere moments to live. We have to hurry. Where the fuck is the distraction? Now I remember. Oh, God. It looks like it's waving all of its limbs around just to talk. Just to walk. Yeah, Roberta. Roberta. Roberta's run is very, um... How do you say spastic? Torment when Torment runs, he runs a full tilt, he is going. Roberta is like Oh god, Roberta just fucking She just she just fucking flails. Alright, this fucking little dumb puzzle here. Puzzle is even is almost even not worth it. Yay, for no fall damage! <gasps> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Fuck! Roberta's packing! Good God! <laughs> Fuck! Damn, didn't know she was cool like that! That was actually really- that was genuinely funny for a second there. Fuck, it just- just moves around at lights. I swear to god, they were making her faster! I also don't know exactly what Neopet they are, because this is Neopet's the Darkest Fairy. Like I, I know I know the fucking thing's called a Yaksha, the one that we're saving, or an Aisha. I don't fucking know. I always just called Roberta Twi'lek because she looked like a Twi'lek from fucking um, Star Wars. We did it! We made some noise! What is causing that infernal racket? Like I said, literally casual torture. <laughs> This game gets unreasonably dark at some points, like, for what- for what this game is, like, watching the old knight get stabbed in the back and murdered, like, on the spot, and you hear the- you can hear the blade ripping through his armor into his flesh, the fucking yacht, the fucking Aisha lady getting casually tortured, like, there- there are some dark moments in this game, it's like, okay, that's- that's unreasonably dark. The king threatening to execute that other guy. It's like, okay, these are, these are, I thought this was just a kid's game. All right, now then. Back to that, Aisha. Hey, D, welcome, oh, fuck! Hey, D, welcome back. Jeez, you've been gone for almost the entire stream, my guy. Oh, fuck. Oh, please don't tell me that was a crash. This is Roberta. It's all right. It's me, the one who got the Harris down for you. I'm going to get you out. You have the heart of a hero. Okay. We can probably take the West Corridor and get out through the- No. What? If we stay together, she'll find us and imprison us both. I'm not leaving you here. Now that I'm out of the shackles, I can get to a place where I'll be safe. But you will need help. Huh? Find this amulet's twin. The one who possesses it can help you before. You have to go now. Get out of Fairyland and find him. Go! So, this is Roberta. She is the princess of Bright Brightvale. Um, she's also a diplomat and sorceress in training. Um, where the fuck do I go now? Alright. So, this is Act 2. Act 1 ended... You missed the apocalypse, essentially, D, is what you missed. 
Like, if you could miss the most, most things, like, you miss the fucking apocalypse. Alright, are we still going in the right direction? Yes, we are. Ah, rip. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'm, I'm going into overtime tonight, so... We'll at least we'll at least get to see Tor again. I might go to Brightwall, I Bright Vale, I don't know for sure. Idiot. There must be another way down. <gasps> the endless staircase. Alright. You guys missed, um, David and Shepard, though. They were here for a bit. Ow! Frames are looking quite smooth right now. Yeah, that's because, um, we're not playing fucking Pal World. I swear to God, they need to re-optimize that game. Still, though, four people working on that game, and the game already as good as it is, honestly. I still haven't hatched the, um, Goth Raid, though. I'm still trying to find, um find the other tablet to actually get the um the other one the libra libro libris libra or whatever you guys know what the fuck i'm talking about or maybe you don't ah, i got slowed by the fucker slowed and cursed this is such a bad day for berta So I was thinking just now about like heading up another save and grinding out so I can do the secret shop, but I literally just thought about, I, I it's a chance to get 75 or 120 Neo points per thing. It's three minutes, or it's around a minute, minute and a half to get the grass. It's not worth it. It's so long. Who has done this? It's 70 cycles at a minimum. I'm sorry, it's 60 cycles at a minimum. And I'm not here for that. I'm just here to fucking play the game and stream. All right, now then, endless staircase, uh, pocket dimension. You're basically stuck here forever, unless you do this. So check this out. All right, so follow the statues, right? This is how you escape the endless staircase. All right, where is this going? It's going left. All right. So you go, you go to where the statue's pointing. Wants well, to go back now. So you go back. Now you go back down this way. Then you go back this way. Then you go back up here. Then you go down. And you made it. For whatever reason that uh, dude i was trying not to say it earlier when we were in illison's glade i'm like dude fucking also those other three like um like goth like hot topic witches that they're under the dark fairies control like straight up i was like jesus winx club in here much but i was like nobody's gonna know what the fuck i'm talking about if i say winx club wow i thought the holy cross puzzle crosses puzzles were crazy yeah Bro, I haven't thought about Winx Club in like fucking forever back. I'm about to throw myself into the bus when I say, I say this. I would get up on Saturday mornings to watch Winx Club and One Piece with my sister. And before you ask, yes, it was on 4Kids. I unironically watched the 4Kids dub with my sister. I ain't even gonna fucking lie. <laughs> I 
I'm sorry. I just, I just, I just thought of something. Stop. No one defies me. Bitch, we're up to three. Fuck you. I was laughing there because of those two gargoyles trying to catch the horse. I was thinking to myself, the average, the average brony trying to fuck a horse. <laughs> I, just, I don't know why. Finally, Act Three. Thank God. Hey, Tormund, welcome back, buddy. Dead. You okay? Hey, are you all right? No, not really. Looks like you're still in one piece to me. Where Why? Did you fall from? <laughs> I know. Fairyland? Oh no, they followed me. What followed you? Oh my god, is that a crash? Oh, thank god. Alright. Bitch. Gotcha. And he's dead. Her only fan subs. Oh god. Are you okay? I'm fine. My name is Tor. Uh, Sir Tor, I guess. Sir Tor, I guess. I'm Roberta. Thank you for helping me with that fight. You are quite good with that sword. You're pretty good with those spells yourself. Thank you. That was the first time I really had to... You have the other amulet. Other amulet? The other amulet? The Aisha who when do we become a knight? Uh, when we saved Cogham. Like I said, D, you missed a lot. You missed the whole, uh, like, ending act he of told me never act to take one. It off. Listen, I know you don't know me, but Fairyland is in trouble. This... this twisted fairy... The darkest one you've ever seen? You've seen her too? She's taken Meridel as well. We have to stop her. Listen. Absolutely no is Wow. Earth. If there is anywhere that we can get help, it's there. As long as she hasn't gotten there first, let's go. You know, the voice actress for Roberta is clearly doing her best, but Tor's voice actor is just better. Like, I hate to be that guy, it's li he's literally just better. Alright, fuck it, we're going into the overtime. How much gold do we have? 2,000 Neo points. That's not enough for a new shield. Alright. So, we're not gonna get a new weapon for a while, but we can grind up for a, um... We can grind up for a new new shield. Okay, that's gonna take fucking forever. Forget it. Alright, so... We don't need to buy a new wand for Roberta, because we can just grab Roberta's training wand in Brightvale. I think we can get enough money on the way because we do have 2,000. I'm not 100% certain, though. That's why I wasn't buying anything as Roberta. Like I said, if we had a couple spare hours, like if this was like a... Just follow the road to the right and we'll eventually see the city. Okay.
key to this game is to spend as little money as possible on bullshit. That's quite literally like a, a strategy for this game. If you're gonna buy something, buy it if you absolutely need it. You wanna save every single Neo point. So me wasting all my money on negs earlier was not a good fucking idea. It was actually very stupid of me if I'm being completely honest. All right, um, let's keep going here. Wait, where is this? Whirlup Woods, beware of whirlups, no shit. Oh, right, 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 you're still locked. All right. Oh, pardon me. Jesus. There could be necks down there, but it's not worth our time, because we have to fucking position that damn turtle to get back up here. We also have enough necks, so it's not worth... Not... Ah! Not worth our time. Is water safe to walk in? Yes, it is. <laughs> I say as I'm jumping into the fucking river. Is this water is this water water shallow enough to walk in? Alley up. Alley alley up. Alley alley up. There we go. All right. More clover. What level of luck are we at? We're nowhere near level four. Okay. Whatever. Okay, are we at Brightvale yet? Okay, yes, we are. We're, we're basically there. So something cool about this game is that you see how, like, you're in the influence of the Darkest Fairy right now. If you actually get further enough, uh, far enough away from her, you can actually see her um, influence to spell, which is actually pretty cool if you ask me. Ah yes, the traveling merchant. Gord the merchant, good day to you travelers. You, you have needs, I've got wares. And don't mind those awful monsters racing about. They don't seem to like the look of my cart. Quite literally. So we got... I'll take the treasure map. When the hell did I get a Draconac thing? Bogshot treasure. We're going to Bogshot, so that's good. That was worth it. I'm gonna grab a few... Vagus, just like three of them. That sword's merit out shit. Only buy it if you absolutely need to. Look, look, it's a treasure map. We'll make back our investment like tenfold. And look at that, we're already back. Also, we need the Bagus. There's a lot of fucking enemies that can poison you in Bogshot, and I don't want to fucking have to take the time. Because to harvest them, you have to risk getting poisoned, and I don't want to fucking go through that bullshit. It's not worth it! I could have also done some more cash grinding in Act 1, but I'm not trying to... 100% this game. I'm just trying to blow through it. Ah, look, a Winnie. It is, it is a memory of better times when my sister and my family weren't under threat of duress and being fucking murdered. Good times. Welcome to Bright Vale. They must be dealt with. Ah, a new customer. How may I be of service? Rumor has it that you are the best at what you do. I have need of such services. My prices are quite high. 
Oh, yes. Your offer is quite generous. I'll take care of them immediately. Dude's just, bro's just casually murdering something as he's talking to her. Also, what's really fucked is we never see that creature he's holding ever again. So as a kid, I always assume he killed it and ate it. Like I said, this game get this game has some unreasonably dark moments, like for what this game is. Alright, um, armorers. Let me see how much that fucking shield costs. Let's see if I can afford that bullshit. Now, how much is this damn shield? Please tell me it's not about 3,000. Oh, sweet! Oh, no! Ah, Roberta will be fine. Yes! A knight's shield. This will stop all but the most powerful attacks. We now have, like, the strongest shield in the, um, in this chapter for now. Um, there's another shield you can get, the golden shield. That's not until you hit Market Town, though. But trust me, this shield is, like, the best. It's a kite heater shield. Now we just need to buy this for Roberta. Or else she will die. Yeah, look at how nice that shield is, man. Actually, let me take the most off this. You guys can truly appreciate Splendor. Look at this. Look at that shield. Beautiful. Yeah, it's sick as fuck, man. Alright, now then. Um... There's something we can do before we end tonight. And that is... The, um... Well, we can talk to the, the king fucker. What is this? Royal potion. Yeah, let's, let's go... Let's go see if there's any, um... Torres shrinking powers, apparently. What do you mean by shrinking powers? There's no one in this fucking shop! Oh, yes, there is. Oh, the shield shrinks? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The shield and the sword shrinks when it's on its back. Then they grow. Just trying to find, like, qu we need money. We need money, so... Uh, that's the problem. We need money. Do you have a quest? Uh-huh. Hmm. Oh. Damn it. I don't... Oh, I forgot you can just buy Nova Motes from, um, from this place. That's right. There's a lot of temptation they give you in this game to spend your money, but say fuck off. You save it for character upgrades. You don't just go spending money willy-nilly. All right. Um, there's no chance time here, but there is, if I remember correctly, there is, in fact, um... Fuck! Jesus Christ, I got... <laughs> I'm sorry, I was I was brain dead there for a second or two. Christ. Um, oh, there is a chance time here. How much cash do we got? Yeah, let's do this real quick, because I know I can do this. I know I can do this with my eyes closed. Let's just do this quick. Alright, while we're in here, let's grab the for the clover. It's actually kind of funny because Tor's um run cycle is actually faster than Roberta's. 
Like, I, I, I genuinely Tor runs faster than Roberta does. Shit. I actually don't know where to go from here. Um, yes, yeah, that way. Damn it, Tort! <laughs> Made it. Alright, now that we got money, let's go save and do some fucking chance time. Let's play this shit like it's lucky hit, like we're playing Shenmue. Let's see if we can't hit the jackpot. Wouldn't that be something? The players actually do talk, uh, or I'm sorry, the NPCs actually do make mention if you do hit the jackpot. It's actually kind of funny. Like how, um, the, um, NPCs in Meridel will, like, talk to you because you're the champion. They'll talk to you like, oh, shit, it's the fucking Mr. Lucky Pants or whatever the fuck. Yes, I can work with this one. Maybe not. Fuck, I already fucked it up. God, I might be able to hit the jackpot here. Uh-oh. Oh my god. No. Being scary here, Chan. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. That's why we back out. We playing, we're playing this shit like it's fucking Shenmue. Going for it. Yes! Yeah! Fuck you! <laughs> Lucky hit, bitch! Oh, look at that cash money. Cash money. Let's go save.
We're rich. We're rich. We literally have a thousand Nia points to spend now. Oh god, to think I was so to think I was so worried about grinding and fucking the thing. All right, let's save, reset the music, cause actually no. No, it's fine without the music. Okay, so we can actually afford to get those. Um, we can actually afford to get those robes for um, Roberta by doing this. So let's keep going, and then we'll just g gamble more. We can safely gamble up to 175, so we only drive from ancient wisdom. Who will step up and challenge it? Yes. Get me back in there. Back in there, you motherfucker. Fuck, too fast. Got it. Yes! We're gonna make him broke with this one, exactly. Especially if we don't do the grand prize every time. No. The grand prize is hard, but we can get 175 easy, so that's what matters. Fuck. Damn, at a certain point they just start speeding up the wheel on you. We just made the money back that we lost. There we go. I got, I got it again. I got it. Three, th uh, three. All right. All right. That's enough um, gambling. Let's go on with the story. But yeah, we quite we're, we're quite literally robbing this man of all of his hard-earned like gambling money. So let's let's give him a break. We already hit the jackpot. All right. Let me see if I can't bring the music back by fucking going into the king. Let's also get Roberta her next wand while we're in here. That's going to take a lot of grinding, so I'm just going to leave that for later. Ah, the music's back. My most esteemed lord and master, King of Brightvale, May I present your niece and premier diplomat, the most gracious lady, Roberta? He knows who I am. <laughs> Shut oh, the fuck there. up, bitch! I didn't see Sonorum arrive. What news from Fairyland? Good news, I trust. Fairyland has fallen, Uncle. Overcome by the same forces that overwhelmed Merrick. Right, I'm but sorry, she's she's possible. the adopted princess. Fiona My bad. Was our only hope. We must get Sarodor on this right away. He's fallen as well, Uncle. The clouds change Neopets, sire. It drives them mad. Your sorcerer is now one of them. Then, then there is no hope. My advisors say the clouds will be upon us in less than three days. It has already swallowed Bogshot and Market Town. There is some hope, Uncle. These amulets, 
They offer protection against the clouds. We were charged to keep them on us at all costs. If we can enter the clouds and find the source of their dark magic, we might find a way to stop them. This sounds awfully dangerous for a diplomat. Maybe a mother should... I never wanted to be a diplomat. I'm a sorceress. To be fair, sire, I've seen her use her spell. She's quite good. Really, she is. It seems I've little choice in the matter. So be it. You are charged as champions of Bright Vale to find the source of this evil and put an end to it. And son... Yes, sire? Take good care of her. Tor just got promoted to second class because he's uh, escorting a princess around. First things first. We need to do some research to see if this has happened before. But how? Where do you find information on purple clouds? You do have books in Maradell, right? <laughs> the most sensible the thing Tor said all but game. I've heard he just uses it to impress princesses. Well, Brightvale prides itself on its books. The Royal Library has practically every book ever written. There must be something there. Come on. This game is so whimsical and childlike. I love it. Yeah, fuck that research. We got something else to do. Because there is a missable weapon upgrade in this castle that you can totally fucking miss because Roberta lives here and she mentions she left a train one behind. Um, here it is, I think. Most epic character switching animation ever. Shit, that's a redneck. Oh, my bad. This is the fucking princess, I think. Yeah, this is Princess Donna. This is, um... Once upon a time, he hated this game. Dude, this game fucking sucks! Don't talk to me about it! <sighs> Wait, my prince were here. Huh? Huh? Take the treasure from my bed chest. Um, already kind of took it. <laughs> already, already kind of took it, lady. Please take the treasure from my bed. Someone took the treasure from my bed chest. Um, yeah. He's in denial. This game fucking sucks. Don't talk to me about it, man. There you go, Roberta. Training one. So here's a funny thing that can happen. Because you can open this chest up as Tor, Tor will actually swing the wand around like a sword if he gets it. So yes, now we have an actual genuine wand. I forget if this wand is hooked up to the wind element or water element. Oh well, no matter. Hang on, well, well, they're both blue. Yeah, it's water. But yeah, dude, don't get it twisted. This 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 game sucks. Like I, what the fuck? What? Oh, it was cyan. Silver Nag. That wasn't worth it. I'm still kind of laughing at. Please take the treasure from my bed chest. Why? Someone already took it. Um. 
Tor's just Tor's just eating the redneck as she's saying he could take it. And she just puts two and two together. She's like, you greedy bastard, you already took it. It's like, yeah, but you, you fucking wanted your shit. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Fuck. Can't jump the railing. Even though there's no fall damage in this game. So I can jump that railing, can't jump this railing. Oh, God. God! This stupid fucking puzzle. I hate this puzzle. Hmm. This puzzle's so fucking stupid. Uh. Gotta find a bunch of fucking levers to push the bookshelves to where they need to be. I actually don't know if I'm thinking wrong or if this is actually. I swear to God, you need to press a lever or something. Oh, hang on, there it is. Read the fucking book. Uh, Darkest Fairy bullshit. So Darkest Fairy was the, 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 the secret secret world. There was a town. She was involved with a group of heroes. Um, she started practicing dark magic. She turned to the dark side. The hero was like, yeah, you bitch. You shouldn't be touching that dark magic shit. And she's like, I'm helping people, though, with my dark magic shit. Then um, the dark magic corrupts her. Then they're like, bitch, it's time for you to be sealed. So they seal her with a magic amulet that turns her into a stone statue. There you go, you're all caught up. I know this game like the back of my hand also. Like I said, D, I've spent too much fucking time on this game as a kid. Unlike modern day, where the fucking Steam sale happened, you, you basically got the games your parents gave you and that's it. That's it! I had this, Kingdom Hearts 2, Battlefront 2, and a bunch of other games, and that's all I had. I had to work with what I had and make my own fun, damn it. Shit was rough, D. You have no idea just how powerful Steam sales made people. Like, I have, I have hundreds of games now. Quite literally, hundreds. Back in the day, I was, it was what my parents got me, and that was it. Or what I was able to beg my parents or convince them into getting me. I had to fight tooth, claw, and nail for Fallout New Vegas D. Especially because I was not old, uh, old enough. I watched the one, I, I watched the same one VHS tape over and over. Yeah. Out of curiosity, what was the tape of? Because I know I've worn out a couple of my old Disney VHSs. Spongebob? Ah, uh, very, very nice. Alright, we just gotta get into the dungeons beneath Meridel and we're set. Alright. Let's go get Roberta her new robe so she doesn't die the second we go to, into fucking, um... So we don't... So she doesn't die the second we go into Bog Shot or else she will die. Alright, so let's do another one of the course... And then uh, we should be able to get the rest of it we need. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
All right, so we'll win a thousand. Easy. Check this shit. I didn't grab it. There's a way you can cheese it by grabbing it off the jump. I fucked up. Tor. Do what I tell your character to do, Tor. Tor, stop. Tor, please. Tor. Nailed it. Under a minute. Oh, think you're all special, do you? Well, I've got a third challenge that no one's ever beaten. So what do you say? You up for it? Nah. I mean, I am up for it, but I want to buy Roberta her stupid fucking robe before we go any further. Because she, Roberta will melt. She has lower defense than Tormund does. These robes really, really make me look the part. This will be the last, like, armor upgrade, like, Roberta gets for a while. Ah! Alright. Let's go finish that last one, and then we'll do a couple spins of Lucky Hit, and then we'll fucking... Um, what time is it? Yeah, I can do a little bit more overtime for you guys. Yeah, fuck it. We can go. We can get, at least get the box shot, I think. Alright. Just for you guys, we'll go, I'll, I'll get the box shot for you guys. <laughs> Only 45 seconds? Damn. 2,000 hmm. Neo points, though. Alright. Let me see if I see if I can do this naturally first. Huh. Hmm. Five seconds to spare. Oh, Slorg Slime. Is your bloody reward. Thanks you for nearly bankrupting me. <laughs> That's what you get for offering that stupid fucking reward. Bitch! <laughs> now, we've quite literally bankrupted one person, and now we have all of our Neo points back. Uh, let's go save and play Lucky Hit till we have 3,000. Alright, potions. We don't need potions. Okay, I take it back. This game can be, like, dumb and kind of fun every now and then. But fun does not equal good game. I mean, it does, but fuck off. Like, you guys are saying, oh, he's enjoying it. No. 
Trust me. There's our big winner. See what I mean? I'll be fine. Boxer has another grinding spot. He's a Brit, apparently. Much better than kick gambling streams. <laughs> Just about, I guess. Alright, let's go. Ah, the fucking... Huh. Let's go back into the castle and see if we can't reset the music again. Because, like I said, if... The more, the more we play with the music being, like, out, the more tired chances game has to bug out and crash. I don't know what causes it. I swear to God. The game's, like, loading screens are, like, linked to the music or something. I think it has something to do with, like, multiple music tracks switching too quickly. And if they play over each other, it crashes the game. That's my best theory anyways. It's kind of risky just going into another area like that, but hey, if the music resets, then we're good. There we go. Now we're cooking with gas. 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 Gas! 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 Gonna step on the gas tonight! Damn it! You could, you could fucking hear the gears turning in my head, trying to think of gas. How do I make this funny? How do I make this funny? God damn it! Oh god! Talk about, talk about late brain. Am I right, chat? Oh god! Who the fuck is messaging me on Discord? What slat? Oh shit! It's good. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Oh shit. He's still alive, I wonder. Hang on. Sorry, it was just it was just a, a thing from Mittens. Hang on a second, chat. I gotta say happy birthday to Mittens real quick. She's doing a birthday subathon for her um stream. Give me a second. I wanna say happy birthday.
All right, and there we go. Sorry about that. Wanted wanted to wanted to wish my friend, my streamer friend a happy birthday. Shit, I had the notification on for a while and I completely fucking forgot about it. Way to go, dingus. Oh well, <laughs> better better late than never. Her birthday's not until Thursday, but her subathon started today. I really ought to do something with Commander Mittens at some point. She's really funny. Crest of Meridel on your map. To, we'll go back the way we came. That will take us to Meridel. Mm. That's right. The Brightfield Bridge is just down the road from where we met near the bridge. That bridge is the only way back to Meridel Castle. Let's go. Yeah, no, we're going to Bogshot. Because the bridge is out, so we go to Bogshot first. Children. Who said that? She sends me up against children. But I promise you one thing. I'll try to make your deaths painless. That fucking... Look at that shitty smile. Look at that walk! Ow, 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 ow! Fucker. What are you doing down there? Yeah, he's darkness. Yeah, no boss music. Maybe I blast him. So anyways, I started blasting! Pow! 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 Oh god, is that a crash? Oh thank god. That's the king's niece. She's being attacked. Hmm. It seems that fate and larger numbers have granted you a reprieve. Doesn't matter to me. I will return at a more convenient time. So yeah, he harrows you throughout the entire game now. The jammy bastard. Peace blah, boss music. Yeah, this game is old, D. The disc itself is old, and my PS2 is full of dust, so yeah, this 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 thing. This is something else. Alright. So we can go to Bog Shot through here. I think we can anyways. Is this the mountain pass I think of? This is the crypt. No, this is the crypt. I'm looking for the dumb mountain pass. Bastard. That's a darkness moat. You can tell because of the gross shit. I'll take those. Damn, these dead people have money on them. I don't remember if this is the, um... Hang on, we'll see in a second here. I don't remember if this is the mountain pass that, like, takes you to Bogshot, or if this is just some other bullshit. Might be. Well, nothing hurts. Check. Uh oh. Okay. Clearly not a good area to be. Oh fuck.
I genuinely don't remember where this mountain pass is. It has to be around here somewhere, though. Is this it? Ah, here it is. This is the mountain pass. But what is over here is the real question. Let us go adventuring. Oh, it's this area. Do I have a bright wall treasure? No, I don't. Yeah, it's a bright bell coast. This is this is um this is this is a, attached to a different quest that we have to do later. So we can get the robes of sh robe of shadows. All right, let's just take the mountain past the bog shot. We're we're wasting time at this point. We have all the upgrades we really need. Okay. Chat, I'm not crazy. You saw that too, right? Welcome to the Bogshot Mountain Pass. The only way into Bogshot at the moment. Because the bridge is out. Hey, like spiders? I don't remember if these guys are weak to... Earth or whatever. Uh, let's try Earth. And then wind. It's hard to tell what enemies are weak to. Alright, 3,000. That's perfect, actually. Fuck you. Taking your shit. Later, nerd. Fuck! Bubble moat? Yes, I did. I forget, can I actually jump for. Yes, I can! Fuck, I forgot I could just jump ropes. Ugh, I hate these poison spiders. It's so annoying. Yeah, I give you same game, save game here, because these are fucking game over this is game over water it's not normal which i don't understand why they programmed it the way they did spider juice elixir what a creepy looking bottle drinking is supposed to ward off the poisonous bites for a short while it's not actually made from spiders is it yes it is actually Fuck up one of these jumps. Alright. We're almost through the mountain pass. More spiders. Fuck!
Thank you. Spiders. Cash. Fuck. Shit. Come on, out of the way, out of the way. Jesus. Oh, fuck. What? Like, you see what I mean? Fucking. Ah. Uh. I like how the Murphy emotes has derpy smiles. Oh, every single moat has a different emotion. God damn it. Like rock, mo rock moat's all grumpy. Shadow moat is like looking sinister. You know, um, fire moat has a big dumb smile on its face. God. Fucking getting tossed into the game over water though. Just ugh. You see what I mean now about like, you know, Hayden's game. Bullshit. Bullshit! The poison hit me mid-air and fucked up my trajectory! That's not fucking fair! God damn it. Oh, I hate this game. I hate this game. I hate this game. Why did I why did I even say I'd play it? What made me think that was a good idea? Fuck! Get some fucking cookies. Fuck this shit. I'm getting some fucking cookies. Game over water makes no fucking sense. Usually, it just respawns you back on the cliff dice or whatever. But this tire is just ah. If I ever figured out who programmed these fucking game over triggers, I'm gonna fucking ugh. Can't take this fucking game. Go. 
uh, wait it out. Now we have to go all the way back. Jesus Christ. Jesus fuck! That was unnecessary game. This stupid game, man. Ugh. I'm so upset right now. Genuinely upset. It's not even funny. I am actually losing it right now. Dar Tor, Tor, Jesus Christ, you jumpy fucking fox. Finally, we're not out of the woods yet either. There, we made it. God dang. Fuck this game.
Ah, finally, signs of life. Non-spider life. Ugh, pardon me. Golden egg. So that one boosts your um, health and your um, magic at the same time. Welcome to Bog Shot. Oh shit! Yeah, box shot's rough. Yeah, we were almost immediately attacked by a fucking big fuck off murder tentacle there, so yeah. Box shot's rough. over there which means civilization structures which means more civilization we're getting close to something Finally, Bog Shot. I actually quite like Bog Shot. Fuck. Wow, Juppy. Thanks. Pretty sure everyone here is under the influence. It's the servant's turns, I tell you. My path used to talk about it. Too sick to work, the whole world could be falling apart, and I can't do anything about it. You could help Bog Shot, Pop Carry, Fog. Alright. So this guy will actually forge you your next uh, weapon upgrade for free, which is why I was so adamant about getting the shield upgrade. Because you need that to get through fucking, um, yeah. The builders, you I think it is. Tome of Warping? Oh, Tome of Warding. 
is this? I've never seen this before. I don't think I've ever seen- what the fuck is Tome of Warding? Okay, okay, I see what's up. Alright. Sorry, I was just checking that and just like looking at what the fuck it was before I bought it. So this is a shield upgrade for her. Yeah, it's not worth it. She'll be fine. She doesn't need she doesn't need to bounce before check those back. I played most of this game as Tor anyways. berries white red and black <laughs> got it all right but that is where we're calling it for tonight at least um, if there is a place to save anyways um, okay then I don't see anywhere to save fuck um, genuinely I don't see a place to save that's a problem I don't see a single fucking save platform anywhere. What the fuck? Oh god. Ah, there we go. Alright, hope you all enjoyed the show. I'll see you tomorrow. So, good night and goodbye.